know how we need to adjust that volume. DBD2 Electric Boogaloo. Hi everyone, thanks for joining us. My name is Carla Rylance. And I'm Natalie Puhalski. And we are thrilled to be your host today for Behavior Interactive's first ever Behavior Beyond Showcase. Today, we're going to be revealing a first look at some key titles from our diverse slate of upcoming games. Multiple titles. We'll explore a unique puzzle multiplayer set in a breathtaking open world of mystery and wonder. A kinetic brawler where your greatest weapon is gravity itself. We'll also be taking a look at the newly released Jurassic World Primal Ops and sharing an update on the fan favorite, Hooked on You, a Dead by Daylight dating sim. The game we didn't know you couldn't live without. And to close the show, we'll premiere the next highly anticipated <laughs> chapter in Dead by Daylight. I know Resident it. Evil Project. You gotta watch Day. the timeshare before but you first, get your tickets to Disneyland. We are incredibly time excited to kick comes things first. off with the world premiere of the next major release from Behavior Interactive. This game mixes creativity, strategy, and action in ways you have never seen before. And Sis. in proper behavior fashion, is guaranteed to make for some truly unique shared moments. We call it... Meet, Meet your, maker. your Maker! Okay, that was the other one. I was like, Meet Your Maker or Exterminat. So the two trademarks that they applied for. Custodian. In the wasteland, only one thing matters. Pure genetic material. Take all you can and build anything to protect it. and then you try and destroy other people's fortresses and raid it for resources? Sign up to participate in the closed play test. Coming 2023. Oh. On June 10th, Jurassic World Dominion topped the global box office, pulling fans of the franchise into a brand new world where dinosaurs now live alongside humans. Now, the story of that world continues to unfold with Jurassic World Primal Ops. Let's catch up with the dev team to see how me. I didn't they think brought there would this be massive any, uh, new adventure to life. License stuff on here. I mean, I guess Resident Jurassic Evil's World Primal fun. Ops is a very welcome addition to the Jurassic World gaming universe, and what we are is the first action adventure game in that space for mobile. When you summon your uh, your large Raptor dinosaur companions, like a T Rex comes stomping through, that's like an unforgettable moment. You know, we just kind of came up with this idea of destructible assets, destructible environments. Everything must be destructible, and uh, it was always said that it couldn't be done, but here we are. It's in there. C'est justement comprendre en fait les dinosaures, de voir c'est quoi leurs différentes particularités, de choisir le bon match pour les apporter dans une mission. Je suis assez fière de travailler sur Jurassic. It's just it's such a big franchise that uh, the name holds a lot of weight. So there's a little bit I don't want to say pressure, but you want to do good by the franchise. <laughs> 
you want to make sure that the, the fans of this franchise who have been fans for like over 20 years uh, that they like <laughs> it that we're uh, being truthful to the dinosaur being truthful to the yes, franchise Emil, what you it stands destroy for the entire the earth just franchise down. itself i think has captured imagination for quite Ain't a long mystic. time to be a part of something that has touched so many people is nothing short i mean of an they've honor. done like game collapse with other licenses like the game of thrones game i guess they're at their heart that's what behavior was right they just made games for other properties bugs bunny toy story that stuff was like that incredible congrats to the entire team on delivering an epic jurassic world experience and jurassic world dominion is in theaters now Bill? So, Carla, do you by any chance remember that surprise announcement that we made back in May? Oh, you know, the one that made a very thirsty Dead by Daylight community even thirstier? Well, how could I forget? Yes, that's right. <laughs> Hooked on You, a Dead by Daylight dating sim is out and available to buy right now, as in today. Our next game takes us from the beach to the furthest reaches of the cosmos. Here in deep space, a fun-loving gang of outsiders host a wild fighting game where the party never stops and the rules of gravity are yours to bend. Here is your first look at Flippin' Misfits. Flippin' Misfits? What is this? For the next game on our list, we'll be partnering with a fellow developer, in this case, the team at Lunark Studios, to bring an intriguing new IP to life. It takes place in a gorgeous open world where exploration is everything, and a curious mind is the only weapon you'll need. This has got to be Exterminauts. Hi, I'm Elliot Grant, CEO and Game Director at Lunark Studios. And today we'll be sharing a first glimpse of a new untitled game we're currently calling Project oh, S. Wow. How many an games original are they making? Open world multiplayer puzzle game that we're developing in partnership with our friends at Behavior Interactive. They're hitting like a lot of different genres here. Wow, that looks beautiful. This looks really cool. Uh, oh, I don't know if 
I have enough brains for this. What is this? Too low for this. <laughs> it reminds me of that one game I saw Jacksepticeye play. As you just saw, where you Project had a S human takes place character in a and a mysterious realm filled with together. floating islands, ancient architecture, and awe inspiring vistas, which you and your fellow explorers can discover in a number of solo or multiplayer game modes. Embedded in the landscape, you'll find a massive variety of otherworldly puzzles to solve. As you explore the different areas of the world, you'll complete quests, find secrets, and discover new puzzle islands, all while learning more about the origin and fate of this mysterious universe. Hi everyone, I'm Mathieu Côté. I'm the Head of Partnerships at Behavior. And today I'm super excited to bring you our second collaboration with Capcom in order to extend the Resident Evil content in Dead by Daylight. Now, with this new chapter, the goal for us was to go bigger and deeper with the introduction of three new characters from the Resident Evil franchise and to add some big improvements to the Raccoon City Police Station map. We hope that you enjoy these additions. Now, whether you prefer to play as Jill, Leon, Nemesis, or some of the new characters we're about to announce, we're very proud of the fact that this is only possible to do in one place, and that is Dead by Daylight. Now, that's it for me today. Dave, why don't you tell us a bit more about this big family reunion. Hey everyone, I'm Dave Richard, Creative Director on Dead by Daylight. First of all, I would like to thank you all for the great reception when we revealed the teaser for the new Resident Evil chapter a few weeks ago during our sixth anniversary broadcast. Today, I'm glad to be back to share more details about it. As some of you may know, it's the first time in the history of Dead by Daylight that we are creating a second chapter in the same licensed universe. As a Resident Evil fan myself, I could not be happier to see the second collaboration come to life. So let's talk about the content of Dead by Daylight, Resident Evil, Project W. Okay. to see the dawn. Oh, it's so cool. Let's start with the two survivors for this chapter. Oh, we get more. Our first new survivor is Ada Wong, the enigmatic underworld spy. Our unique perks highlight our adaptability to face impossible situations, and they will make you feel like a highly trained double agent. The second survivor is Rebecca Chambers, the biochemistry prodigy. Her unique perks highlight her support skill as a STARS medic and the fact that she is a very fast learner. Now for the killer. After choosing a classic monster from the Resident Evil universe last year with the Nemesis, we've decided to go a different route. This new chapter focuses on the series' iconic villain, the mastermind Albert Wesker, the cold-blooded, ambitious, and driven virologist. Wesker will use his Euroboros superhuman abilities to dash at incredible speed and attempt to catch survivors. Oh no. Once a survivor is caught, depending on the situation, Wesker can tackle them, throw them, and try to hinder them, or pick them up instantly. Hug? Of course, it would not be a true Resident Evil experience if there would not be some sort of infection in the power. And thus, any survivor that's caught by Wesker's dash is infected with the Euroboros virus. This will slow down their movement speed, making them even easier preys. 
Survivors can alleviate the infection by using sprays found in supply crates around the maps. Wesker comes with three unique perks, and they will match his unyielding discipline and will make you feel like an elite superhuman and a grand schemer. Also coming with the new release, some quality of life changes to the Raccoon City Police Station map. We heard your feedback and we analyzed it. And the team worked really hard to make it more enjoyable to play while staying true to the overall Resident Evil feel and design. Moving forward, the Raccoon City Police Station will be split in two separate maps, built around the West and the East Wing. The main hall will remain a consistent presence on both maps, but this new layout will mean that both of the maps will be smaller than the wow. original. It would also be far easier to take the action outside with additional access to the exterior section. Oh. We've also improved the general flow of navigation by making the maps more porous. There's more entry points now in various rooms and walls. We've also added more space to corridors and rooms, Love it. make it more breathable, and enable a better gameplay in chases. Some of those corner hooks. Finally, are just we've so worked campable. on various other quality of life improvements, like reducing dead ends. The updates to the map will, of course, be available for free for all Dead by Daylight players. And that's a wrap on our very first Behavior Beyond. Remember, Jurassic World Primal Ops and Hooked on You, a Dead by Daylight dating sim, are both available for you to play today, as in right now. No waiting required. So go check them out. The gravity swapping chaos of flipping misfits and Dead by Daylight's terrifying new Resident Evil chapter, Project W, are both right around the corner, with Resident Evil <laughs> Project W's PTB out very soon followed by the start of your quest for wisdom with Project Very S soon. in 2023. We also got an absolutely epic reveal of the one-of-a-kind post-apocalyptic building and raiding game Meet Your Maker. You can head over to the game's website today to sign up for their closed playtest beginning later this month. And keep watching right now for an hour-long Meet Your Maker panel featuring tons of exclusive gameplay. Okay. Thank you for I'm joining us for our first that. ever Behavior Beyond. We'll see you next the... time. I hooked on you. It's a generous life for us. It's a generous life for us. Set a hiding, we do gens. Set a randoms, we got friends. It's a generous life.